Today's moon in Cancer brings up the maternal and protective sides of our personalities. But if we hold on too tightly to life as it is, we can be in for a very rough ride tonight. I'm Jeff Jower. And for Planet Pulse on this Thursday, October 24th, I'm Rick Levine. I agree with you, Jeff. I think we have not only the moon in Cancer, but we have Jupiter in Cancer, too. That Jupiter's doing its own dance will get... Well, that actually starts the day off. And in a way, because Jupiter starts the day off in an aspect with Mars, there is enthusiasm, there is an upbeat feeling, but it's in Cancer, and, and the moon is in Cancer, so we may not get to express our feelings, but they're big already and they get bigger as the day goes on. Yeah, active Mars in a 45 degree angle, an angle of some stress or tension with expansive Jupiter is big energy, but not only as you said, Rick, is Jupiter in the more protective sign of Cancer, but Mars is in the discreet and cautious sign of Virgo. Virgo sure. So it's a very interesting, just on a pure planet level, it's like push, push, but when we include the meaning of the signs, it's like push, push by very well-behaved religious people knocking at your door. Hi, I don't mean to be pushy, but, and I'm, I'm really here for you, but you're going to hell unless you do what I do. But the you. fact is that there really is an enthusiastic or or, or a message behind it. Well, there there is that. And, and yet I think what happens is that as the moon moves through Cancer, by the end of the day, it makes contact with the Uranus-Pluto square, which is exact next week, the beginning of November. But it's so close already that the moon in Cancer kind of, it bumps into the anger and the resentment of like, if you got something to say, damn it, why don't you just say it instead of keeping it to yourself and making me have to dig it out of you, or maybe it's my stuff that I don't want to express and I'm feeling like you're pushing and trying to dig it out of, there's something that's going on that, that develops up into a feeling of dissatisfaction that really can push my feelings over the edge. And yet if we're honest enough to express feelings in a strong way, that can have a profound and possibly damaging effect on a relationship. I'm Jeff Jower. And for Planet Pulse, I'm Rick Levine.